So let's talk about something most people don't even realize is happening. Your Android phone, yes, the one in your hand or pocket right now, could be tracking almost everything you do. And it's doing this quietly in the background through the Play Store. Now, I don't mean full-blown surveillance, but still, it's enough to make you think twice. Things like what apps you're using, how long you're using them, and even what you do inside those apps, all being sent to developers or stored by Google. The worst part? These settings are turned on by default. But don't worry, I'm going to walk you through every setting you need to change to stop the spying, cut down on battery drain, and make your phone a lot faster too. No special tech skills needed. All right, let's jump in. Go ahead and open the Play Store app on your phone. Now, look up at the top right corner of your screen and tap your profile photo. That's going to open a bunch of options. Scroll down a bit and tap on something called Play Protect. You'll land on a screen that shows whether Play Protect has scanned your apps recently. Now, and this is important, look in the top right corner again and tap on that little gear icon. You'll see two switches here. The first one says, scan apps with Play Protect. Leave that on. This is actually a good feature. It checks your apps for malware and harmful stuff, and lets you know if anything looks shady. But the second one, improve harmful app detection, that's where the spying starts. This one collects information about which apps you use and what you do inside them, then sends that data to Google or app developers. Turn that off. You don't need it. It doesn't help you, and it uses up your phone's resources behind the scenes. Now this might sound weird, but to turn off some of the worst spying features, you actually need to update the Play Store first. Some of these settings only show up once you've got the latest version. So let's do that. Tap your profile photo again, go to Settings, then tap About. At the bottom, you'll see something that says Update Play Store. Tap that. If it says your Play Store is already up to date, perfect. If not, go ahead and update it now. Now that your Play Store is up to date, Head back to Settings in the Play Store. This time, tap on General. Scroll down a little, and you'll see a feature called App Install Optimization. Here's the deal with this one. It watches how you open, run, and use apps. So it can optimize installations in the future. That's great for developers, but it means more background tracking, more data being sent, and more battery being used. You're better off without it. Turn it off. All right, let's talk battery life. If your phone dies too fast, apps could be running nonstop in the background, and we can change that. Go back to the Play Store. Tap your profile photo again. Scroll all the way down and tap Help and Feedback. In the search bar, just type Delete. Yeah, really, just Delete. Now tap the option that says Delete apps on your Android device. Scroll down and tap Tap to go to Application Settings. This opens a list of all the apps on your phone. Pick an app from the top, maybe Chrome or YouTube. Now tap on battery. You might see three options here, unrestricted, optimized, and restricted. If it's set to unrestricted, that means it can run 24 seven, draining your battery in the background, even if you're not using it. Tap it and switch to optimized. Go through your list and check other apps too. You don't have to do them all at once. But the more you optimize, the longer your battery will last. All right, here's a setting most people have never even heard of. It's not in the Play Store. You'll find it in your phone's main settings. So back out of everything and open your Settings app. Now scroll to Privacy and tap Usage and Diagnostics. And yep, you guessed it, turn it off. This setting collects info like how often you charge your phone, what features you use, when you unlock your screen, and it sends all that data over the internet. It runs constantly in the background. It burns your battery, eats up your mobile data, and for what? So someone can make a chart about when you open your calculator app? You don't need it. Shut it down. You've just taken back control from a bunch of hidden settings that were working against you the whole time. Now your phone's a little faster, your battery lasts longer, and your personal habits a lot more private. Most people never touch these settings. They don't even know they exist. But now you do, and you've done something about it. So give yourself a pat on the back. If this video helped you, go ahead and hit that like button. Maybe even share it with a friend or two who always wonder why their battery's at 10% by lunchtime.
Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.